what's up welcome back to the channel um so you're feeling unmotivated to get to the gym i totally get you totally get you on this um who has motivation to want to work out not many people right um but I'm here to help you. I'm not here to, I won't say I have a solution for the problem, but I do have five tips that are sure to help you um, stay motivated when you're not necessarily feeling it. So step number one, pick out your clothes the night before. Why? Because it's, it's setting you up for success. It's, allowing you to just have everything ready to go, have it all together. That way you're not waking up, you're looking for your clothes, and then you're finding reasons to not wanna to go to the gym. Well, I can't find my clothes. Well, I don't have, I don't know where my water bottle is. We make up excuses all of the time. Can you think of how many excuses you make on a day-to-day -day basis? I can name five right now, just inside my head right now. Um, so have your night, have your clothes picked out the night before. Have everything ready to go. Number two, um, I don't care if you guys listen to podcasts. I don't care if you listen to like your favorite playlist. Plug, unplug from your from your phone or what have you, or or um, put on put on Pandora um, in your house, in your car, where have you, where where have you, wherever. Plug in to your favorite podcast. Mine is, uh, I like to listen to a lot of Mel Robbins. I love listening to Gary V. Gary V is the shit. I hope he hears me say that because I absolutely love Gary V. He's so pumped up. He's so motivational. He is. He actually gets me, he, um, he helps with my motivation, especially like when I don't want to work out or I'm finding excuses um, for for anything, um, he helps me. So Gary V, Mel Robbins, I can name a whole list of people, but put in your favorite playlist, um, you know, whether you listen to um, hip hop or what have you, put something on that's going to help get your blood flowing, right? Help get your energy up. It is a proven fact if you listen, well, at least, I mean, for me, it works. If you're listening to music, um, you're, you're getting in the groove. You're moving, right? Your blood is flowing. You're already moving. So what excuse do you have to not want to get to the gym, right? So um, put on your favorite playlist. Number three is um, set your alarm 30 minutes earlier when you wake up. So um, that again, it sets the mood. It allows you to prepare everything. So your clothes, your water bottle, your gym bag, you've got everything. And again, you don't have an excuse as to why you can't get to the gym. At least, at least I hope you don't have an excuse. Otherwise, these, these tips are irrelevant, right? So um, make sure that you're prepared. Make sure that you have everything ready to go. Um, you know, and I think one of the things that has always helped me was to set that alarm, make sure I'm getting up early. Um, number four, number four, number four, just not making any excuses. I know it's easier said than done, but having not making any excuses as to why you can't get to the gym, um, just don't make any. You know, don't. Um, number five is just just go, just go. I mean, I know it's hard, and I know we're not we're not naturally motivated, right? But listen to if you haven't if you haven't so already. I definitely recommend you listening to my last video on my morning routine where I talk about the the five four three two one. Uh, rule of Mel Robbins. Mel Robbins is an author. She's an entrepreneur. Um, she's a motivational speaker. She is amazing. And she talks about incorporating this rule 
um, you know, into this method rather into your life. And basically all it is, it's very, very simple. Literally before you wake up, and let's say you don't want to wake up because especially on a, on a weekend, if you're not working, we, we just want to sleep in, right? So she talks about incorporating this method. So you go five, four, three, two, one. And I know it sounds silly, but it works. It, for whatever reason, just programs you in a way where you don't have any excuses and you're up. And then that could be for anything. So I really hope that these tips help you. Um, I would love to hear your feedback on these videos. Even if you guys have feedback on how I can improve some of these videos, I will take that as well. Like I said, I like to be open, honest, real, authentic with you. Um, you know, and, and if I can do that through these videos, then I'm doing my job. So make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that little bell so you never miss an update. And I will catch you on the next video. Have a great day, guys.